Hello and welcome. In this video tutorial of Windows tips and tricks, I'm going to show you how to check a computer if it can be upgraded to Windows 11 or a Windows 11 can be installed on it or not. Microsoft has recently announced a new version of Windows OS that is Windows 11 and published most of the new features of Windows 11 on its official website. Also, Microsoft has announced the minimum system requirements that a PC should already have in order to install Windows 11, which we will see at the end of this video. So please keep on watching. To check whether your computer is compatible to run Windows 11, simply open your browser and search for upgrade to Windows 11. Click on the first link of Microsoft official website or click on the link provided in the description below. Now scroll down all the way until you get the check compatibility section. Here click on download app. Currently I am using a desktop PC and I am checking for the Windows 11 installation compatibility on it. It's quite an old PC. However, I will also show you checking the same in a laptop that was bought recently. Now the compatibility checker software is also downloaded. Click on it. Wait until the installation is complete. Click on check now button. It may take some time depending upon your PC speed. I just fast forward this video. Well in this PC, we get the message like your organization manages updates on this PC. For info about getting Windows 11, contact your IT admin or click on learn more. Clicking on learn more, it only redirects you to the Microsoft's official website instead of providing the actual cause of the problem. We'll create a separate video about this. So that means Windows 11 cannot be installed on this computer without resolving this issue. Another thing that need to be checked before trying to install or upgrade to Windows 11 is the trusted platform module or TPM version 2.0. TPM is a chip that is built on the motherboard and it is mandatory for Windows 11. So let's check on this PC whether TPM chip is built on the motherboard and decide whether this PC can run the new version of Windows OS that is Windows 11. Just press Windows key on your laptop, type PowerShell, right click on it and click on run as administrator. Here type get dash tpm and hit enter as you can see the tpm present is false which means this pc doesn't have the tpm chip so we can't install or upgrade to windows 11. let's move on to our laptop and check here let's first check whether tpm is present or not let's open the powershell as an administrator and issue the command get dash tpm as you can see, the TPM present is true. We know that this laptop can go for Windows 11 by TPM's side. Also, let's check the TPM version which needs to be 2.0 to install or upgrade Windows 11. To check the TPM version, open command prompt and issue the command tpm.msc. As you can see, the TPM specification version is 2.0. Also let's check by downloading the upgrade checker software from the Microsoft official website and run it. Here you go. This laptop can run Windows 11 without any issue. If it couldn't due to insufficient minimum system requirement, it would give the message like displayed on the screen. To know when you can upgrade your laptop to Windows 11. Microsoft will let you know in your Windows update section when it's ready to install. For this, click on start button or just press Windows key on your keyboard, type check for updates and click on it. Here click on check for updates. When the Windows 11 is ready to be installed on your computer, Microsoft will let you know in this particular section itself. So keep on checking. Now uh, talking about the basic requirements. You should have 64-bit processor with frequency more than 1 GHz with 2 or more cores or an AMD Ryzen processor 
of above second generation. Main memory or the RAM should be at least 4 GB and secondary memory or the hard disk or SSD should be at least 64 GB. Your hardware system should be UEFI enabled or your PC should be capable of secure boot. TPM chip should be there on the motherboard and TPM should have been enabled from the BIOS. The TPM version must be of at least 2.0. About how to enable TPM from BIOS, please check out our channel. Talking about the graphics card, you should have at least DirectX 12 compatible graphics. And display and internet connection required as shown here. Okay, this is how we can check whether our PC is compatible to run Windows 11. I hope the video was useful to you. Please subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. See you on other videos. Till then, have a nice time, take care, goodbye.